hang up now. When you just I raised. said hang up! Hello, Mrs. Williams. Yeah, I will call you. Tell me phone! Um, babe, can you help me to You know, the last time. Okay. Yes, I forgot. I'm so sorry. Okay, I'll make it up to you. I'm so sorry. But you know we have an outstanding deal we are yet to sign. Honey, you've been on this call for up to an hour right now. What is going on? I saw you in the kitchen making the same call. Babe, please just hold on. Once I'm done, I'll talk to you. Okay? Wait, wait. Are you seeing... I should hold on for you to make your stupid call. Babe, I'm talking to a client. Hold on. Oh, you want to fool me? You're talking to a client and you're smiling at the kitchen? Now, I heard what you said. Uh, it was fun. And you've been talking to a client for close to two hours. What business are you discussing? No. <sighs> Tell me. Babe, you need to understand. Please, I'll soon be done. Hang up now. When it just I said hang up! Hello, Mrs. Williams. Yeah, I will call you. Tell me phone! What did you do that for? You know what? I think very soon you'll be ending this stupid career of yours. Nonsense. But reaching my wardrobe, I couldn't find any of my clothes. Oh, I burnt them all. What? You burnt my clothes? Why? You know, I went through your wardrobe yesterday and I noticed that every outfit there are revealing. You're an housewife and you should be wearing something proper. What are you saying, Frederick? I have a show I have to attend. I've been paid in full for it. Um. It's simple. So, Chloe, I'll be getting you some new clothes so you look like a proper housewife. And about the show, don't worry, they'll be getting a refund. And that reminds me, um, Chloe, you'll be ending your career today. No. No, you can't end my career. No, this is my life. You can't. Chloe, my decision is final. Frederick. Frederick. Come in, the door is not locked. Frederick. Elliot. <laughs> My man. Please wait. Thanks. Oh. Elliot? Yeah. I was not expecting to see you today. You know, I wanted it to be a surprise. Oh, you actually came at the right time. You know, the football match will be starting in an hour time. So we just didn't match that. Oh, that's true. So, um, should I offer you anything? No, 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 no. I'm fine. You didn't come to your wife? No, I didn't. If you had come to your wife, she would have kept Chloe company. That's true. Is Chloe around? Yes, she's in her room. Um, I'll just say hi to her before I leave. Um, that's fine. So, about your wife, where is she? Um, she's currently at Dubai for a girls' hangout. What? Your wife is in Dubai and you are here? Yes, I just told you she went with her friends. Aren't you scared that those men in Dubai might take your wife from you? <laughs> Come on. I trust my wife. You know, we've built a lot together. And if I don't trust her, 
What do we have? I believe she's fine. You know, she's out there having some fun. In a few days' time, she'll be back. You know, women put a lot in the family. Getting pregnant, raising the kids, taking good care of the family. You know, sometimes we should always give them a break. You know, life doesn't have to always revolve around us, the men. You know, I've never thought of it this way. And um, I have actually been having some issues in my home. Really? Tell me about it. You know, Chloe sings. Everybody wants to be friends with her. Everyone wants a number. You really need to see the way men flaunt around her during occasions. It's alarming. I hear a lot of comments like, Wow, you're beautiful and you know how to sing. Can I invite you to my show? Wow, that's good. No, it is not good. I don't know their true intentions. I am scared they might take my wife away from me. So I asked her to end her music career. You didn't have to do that. Look at me. Can I tell you something? Yeah, sure. You are insecure. Insecure? No, I'm not. I just want to protect my wife. I want to be with her always. I love her so much. And I am not ready to share with anyone. Frederick, take it from me. You are insecure. Really? But I never knew I was insecure. I was only trying to be careful. I think you owe your wife an apology. Are you sure if I give her that freedom, I won't regret it? No. It's all about trust. <laughs> she has her own life to live. If you think Kejina wouldn't make a cheat, you are wrong. My friend, you owe your wife an apology. I'd like to apologize to you for everything that I have done. You know, burning your clothes especially. And also asking you to end your music career. Only to be honest, I was only trying to watch over you. I, I can't get the thoughts of another man taking you away from me. I did not know I was insecure. Only to be honest, I am really sorry. If you give me another chance to be your husband, I will be a better man and I will make you happy. Truly, your actions were too much for me to bear. But I think I understand why you did that. I want you to know that no one can take me away from you. And of course, you're still my husband. I want to promise you right now that I will work on myself. Babe. I love you. I love you too. I love you so much. Yeah. And uh, guess what, babe? What? I got you this. Really? Yes. Wow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> They're really nice. This is beautiful. Wow. You know, after I burned your previous love, I decided to get you something better. Oh, thank you. That's so nice. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, and um, secondly, guess what? What? I got you a music gig. Oh! Wait. Oh my goodness! Relax. Don't be too excited. We'll talk about it later. So, what should I get for you? Mm, we should eat out. Really? Yes. Okay, let's go shower then. <laughs> <laughs> 